All right, this is continuing from the other video I did, the products that I like. Um, the products that I'm currently using now and they seem to be working for me. Um, I've been using the Herbal Essences line. Just the conditioner. The only shampoo, I'll show you the shampoo, but I'm going to start off with the conditioner. I use the Herbal Essences High Delicious Self-Targeted Conditioner and it has red vanilla and uh, aloe in it. So this is what it looks like right here. I use this for a co-wash and it smells good. So this feels good in my hair. It leaves my hair soft. I'm starting to like it, but I mean I'm liking it, but I can't I haven't been using it enough to say that I love it. Um I've been using the Herbal Essence of Tallow Hydration Moisturizing Conditioner with the fusion of orchid and coconut orchid and coconut milk. <coughs> this right here. I got the big bottle and yes, this has been working for me. Um so far I love it. This, I haven't been using it as much. I would say that I love it, but this, I'm starting to love. And, <coughs> sorry guys. And the other conditioner I use is the Sun Silk Captivating Curls. Just conditioner, no shampoo. I'm trying to stay away from as much shampoo as possible. But if I need it, if my hair is starting to feel icky, then I'll use it. But I've been using the D French conditioner by Sun Silk, the Captivating Curls. Um, I haven't really been using it that much, like I said, to say that I love it. But you know, if I'm starting to run out or I'm running late or just something to grab, then I'll co-wash with this. I just do co-washes now, people. I don't really use shampoo. Um, yeah, the shampoo that I use. It's by Herbal Essences Breaks Over with the music Cocoa Mango and Pearls. My hair tends to break. I don't remember like when I was transitioning, my hair just broke off real bad. Because I didn't take care of it the way I should have. And even when I was relaxed, my hair was breaking off real bad. So to prevent that, I'm like, hey, I'm going to try this. The Breaks Over. And I use this one. The only time I'll use shampoo is when my um, hair starts to feel like real icky and nasty, like dandruff and everything. And that's when I'll use shampoo. When my hair is feeling like musty and, I don't know, just like I got build up or something, then I'll co-wash it. Um, conditioner, I use this for a co-wash. I haven't used it in a while, but I used this as a co-wash when I was relaxed, basically. When I was relaxed. And I used the shampoo. Yes, y'all are like, why? This stuff is drying. Especially the shampoo. The conditioner is not bad, but this is so drying to the hair. And I wash my hair every week, too. And putting the hair on your hair, put heat on your hair once a week is already bad enough. So this I don't know, but if I was to run out of all my products or whatever, or someone was to come over, then I'll have this. I don't like it like that, but, no, I don't like it. Um, and, I use the Lustrous Hill Olive Oil Cholesterol and the Lustrous Hill Shea Butter Cholesterol. And, um, and it has mango. This, I love. You can use it as a leave-in. You can wash it out. You can do whatever you want with this, really. Um, but I mixed it. I mixed it, and it's kind of like a, I don't know if y'all can see it. It's like a runny consistency. So is the other one, but it doesn't bother me. But I mixed this with the Softy Cholesterol Plus Ahova Oil, the conditioning stuff. So basically with this, I won't necessarily leave it in my hair anymore because I mixed it with this. This, I got for a dollar at my local dollar store. And it, um, it's pink. I don't know if y'all can see that. It's pink at the bottom. It's out. And I mixed it in with this. And this is a good deep condition treatment thing. 
but I also use this. This basically with this, it depends on how I'm feeling type of situation. But with this, I love. I said it with a hooded cap, a hooded heat cap. You know, I don't use heat caps, but I use plastic bag. Yes, plastic bag. Who needs money to go sit there and buy plastic caps? We can just use a trash bag and got for free. <coughs> Sorry. But it's just kind of runny, like I was saying. I like it though. It works for me. That goes for all the shampoo conditioners. Now let's go into the products that I absolutely hate. No, sorry, let's not go there yet. The African Essence Protein Styling Gel. Now this doesn't flake my, I'm about to get there. Matter of fact, no, I'm going to talk about the products that I hate. Sorry guys, I'm messing with y'all. Alright, a product that I absolutely hate and never ever probably ever use again, maybe only for an emergency. But, the TCB Foaming Wrap and Set Lotion. This crap. This crap smells like straight alcohol. Like, it smells so bad. Like, it smells like something you rub on a cut. It's just, oh, I hate it. It smells like straight alcohol. I wish I smelled it before I bought it, but this, oh, oh it's. Thanks, I don't like it. Never use it again. I did use this like as an emergency because I know I didn't have wrap lotion for a while. So I use it as an emergency when I did straw sets so my hair on my hair is longer and roller sets and all that, but I'll never use this again. Now let's go with the gel. This gel sorry guys. This gel that I have. I hate so much. So, so, so much. I might probably never ever use it again. Only on like a straw set. The African Essence Stalling Gel. The clear kind. My mom bought this. This works for her hair and my sister's hair. You wanted to slick it back in a ponytail with her hair. It works just fine. But on me... This shit, mm, sorry. It flakes so bad on my hair, like, it don't matter what, I just slick it down. Only time I use it maybe on my side and give it like a swoop, that's it, I don't put it in my hair. This will make your hair flake. I don't like it at all, but it is nice for straw sets to seal the ends on the straw. Other than that, that's it. I hate this kind, this clear kind. But I also have the African Essence Protein Gel. Yes, it's smudged off. But I got this for a dollar. The big cotton is two. Excuse me. Black gel. I use this. If I, when I had my hair relaxed, I used this to slick it down because this was going to flake on my hair and look like I got dandruff and nastiness going on. And this I would use to slick it down. But I add some grease to it so it doesn't give it like a stiff hold. And it seems like the protein gel, it it um it dyes your hair, it gives it like a rinse color, because it is a caramel color. But I like this gel. I prefer this gel over this, but I would mix this probably with a little bit of hair grease or some oil to, if I want to slick it down. Other than that, it's the only thing I would use it for. But other than that, I don't really have to make products that I hate. I mean, the number one, two number one things that I just hated, or three, is this. Do not buy. It smells like alcohol. And this is garbage. And this is not all that great. So, this is the moisture renewal. I would recommend it. But... I'm going to be doing more videos. I'm probably going to be doing at least once a week or so. But thanks for watching. Any questions, concerns, or why I do a certain thing, just leave a message, a comment, whatever, and I'll get back to you.